Hi guys, we are back with Hello. a what's in our well arrows hospital bag. We don't have our Yeah, we don't have bags. ours packed. We're kinda just expecting to just grab stuff and go when it's time. Yeah. And I have nothing in these little pouches. Well you're gonna show them the bag and tell them what kind of bag it is. I have nothing in there. I just thought I'd tell you that. And then in the front, this these is, two. Well, you're not just saying you never said what kind of bag it is. Oh, this is a Vera Bradley. It's technically like a luggage bag, but we were gifted it at our baby shower for a diaper bag, and it has a, a bunch of pockets. So it it's is really a nice. really nice bag. It yeah, it's very nice. But on the little pocket on the outside, we have her little wubbinub. And we also have just a regular Avent pacifier and one of the gumdrop pacifiers. And I have them cleaned. They we sterilize yeah. them, yeah. We use our bottle warmer to sterilize them. That's why they're in a ghetto looking sandwich bag. And then on the inside, in just the big inside pocket, we have this blanket, which was his. Yeah, that was my baby blanket. When he was a baby, which nope. we're just taking it with us so we can take pictures of Arrow on it. Yeah, it doesn't It doesn't say anything, boys. It just says no, baby. No, it just says baby. And the other one had like planes on it. It was more boyish. Yeah. We're not going to actually use these with the baby because I don't want them to get messed up in case we have a boy ever in the future. So we are just gonna take pictures of her yeah. on it at the hospital. Of course it's fine with me. And then we were gifted this at our baby shower by his aunt. Yeah, and it came with a teddy bear, didn't it? Or no, was that, that the was other the one? other one. Okay. But I thought it was really cute and she could hold on to it on the car ride home or yeah. anything. I wanted to bring it, I thought it was cute. And you're weird, but it's fine. And then this blanket, she's going to be using, and we're going to get pictures of her on. Uh, my grandma actually made this for me when I was a baby. Yeah. And it was my baby blanket when I was a baby. So it's going to be arrows. And she's going to wear it home from the hospital. And she's going to get pictures and stuff on it while we're there. Wear it home from the hospital. <laughs> like it's gonna be on her, you know what I mean. And we also packed, we packed a lot of blankets. I just realized that. I forgot I put this one in there too. Yeah, I know. I, I've already no noticed this when you were showing me all of them. I thought the same thing, but I and just let it go. This is her Winnie the Pooh blanket that I got her. This is one of the first things I got when I found out we were having a baby, like that I ordered because I thought it was. The cutest thing ever, because I have a thing for Winnie the Pooh. But this other side, this other side's like really soft. Yeah. It's crazy soft. This will be really warm. So I'm actually glad we packed a lot of blankets, because it's like freezing cold right now. And it's going to be freezing cold when we have her in well, like... a month, pretty much. Less than a month. Yeah. It's getting pretty close yeah. to the due date. And then <sighs> we have a bunch of pockets on the inside filled on with the stuff. Sides. And in one of the little ones... We just have, we have a little hat for her to come home with. Has a little bow on it with polka dots. That's a big bow, sister. It is a big bow, but it's a little hat. It's cute. <laughs> and then we have little mittens, mittens, mittens that have are always adorable. polka dots on there. Those are cute. Her oh, we have bottle. Warm. We need to put bottles in here probably for you to think. No. No? Okay. And I packed these little socks for her to wear while we're there. Just some little, they have little hearts on them. They're really, really tiny. They're cute. They're and tiny socks. You guys will see, but this matches her coming home outfit. So I put them in here because they were really tiny. So I figured they'd fit her probably, most likely. But that's not the only reason why we're taking them. They're really cute and they match her coming home outfit. Because his coming home outfit when he was a baby was Mickey Mouse. So we figured yeah. hers would be Minnie Mouse. So you'll see in a second that these will match it. Because she's my little Minnie Mouse. I just thought about that one. I just came up with that one. That one's that scary. And then I put these in here. I probably won't need any of this stuff. 
because we're going to be at the hospital where they yeah. have, have everything. But I packed a little bib and two little burp cloths because I figured if she threw up everywhere on the way home or if, yeah. I don't know, I'm paranoid about everything. And I packed, in one of her pouches, I packed her two long sleeve onesies just to wear while she's there because we have to stay there for two days now. Three. Three days. One day is for the birth, the second one is, I don't remember, and then there's the third one. I don't know, but this one says, I love dad. I didn't realize how much we packed. You're acting like we're going on a vacation for a week. <laughs> and this one says, I love mom. So she has those Ooh, to wear. Also, we got those at H&M if you're wondering. I remember oh, that. Oh yeah, we did get those at H&M. Actually, we got the coming home onesies. I got those. All of the little outfits we got her. I got those from H&M uh, yeah. too. I order those online now. This is one we brought just in case, like for her to wear while she's there. This isn't the one she's coming home in, but it does have Mickey Mouse, Minnie, Minnie. Mouse Weird on it. <laughs> And this one's the cutest one. This one is the one that she's coming home in, that she's wearing home. And it has little minis all over it. Yeah. With little hearts. It's like little baby mini, just making different faces. <laughs> and it's really, really cute. And I packed her little newborn pants to wear while we're there and people are visiting us. Those are cute. And we packed this little swaddle that has golden hearts. This is from Target. It came in a pack of four. Really? Wow. Yeah. And we are packing this because I do not know how to swallow a baby and neither does he. So <laughs> we're hoping at the hospital they can teach us what to do with this. We also have like the Velcro and like zip up ones if all else fails, but yeah. I want to actually try to do it myself first. And a little receiving blanket is in there because my mom said she used these like crazy when I was a baby, so we have a bunch and yeah. I put one in here because... Why not? Yeah. <laughs> we have everything else, why not one of those? <laughs> and I thought, yeah, on the outside, I didn't do the other outside pocket. We have like two little sample white thingies. I put those in there too, because... Yeah. Why not? We, we need we to get everything else. They only have like 10 wipes in them, so it's not like we can do anything. So yeah. I figured we can get rid of them while we're at the hospital yeah. with her instead of leaving them lay around the house for 10 years. Yeah. But I think that's everything. That's everything for Arrow that we've packed for the hospital. We only have her bag packed, which is probably a bad idea, and we yeah. should probably pack ours because it's getting really close to it the due date. It is getting too close. But I think it'll be all right. We definitely have plenty of stuff for her. Yeah, that's all that matters. Yeah. yeah. It's okay. Well, please like, comment, and subscribe. And if you guys think we forgot anything, yeah. let us know. Seriously. All right, see ya. Bye. Bye.